Hi everyone, this is Darkside2k7, aka Sonic Sky Chaser. I hope you're having a fantastic evening. And also, I'm trying out this new DLC, this new free DLC that I just got for Doom, Doom um, 1 and 2. I'm gonna have to get it for Doom. Yeah, this free, yeah, it's nice getting the cool, these cool mods as free DLC, free add on DLC, which is dope, which is dope. Add it. I guess it's I guess it's uh sin number five on gaming sins about Doom. Make a shit ton of mods to make a game as badass as it already is. <laughs> well, now that I'm that's out of the way, I gotta talk about the what's happening in the NFL lately. So, as you may for so for those of you that don't for those of you that need to know or didn't pay or didn't catch it. Um, uh, well, I made a, yours truly made a video about the whole, um, about the whole COVID-19 protocol, protocol thing that they're doing. Yeah, yeah, y y you know, the one where, you know, the one where the NFL decided to make a, to make a crap ton of, decided to make, ow, 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 ow. okay, what the, it's killing me. Oh, I see, you know. Yeah, for some reason they decided. Um, okay, so for some reason the NFL decided to make this whole thing a make this whole thing for teams to get everyone everyone vaccinated. Now, listen here. I'm not no doctor, never was, but I feel like if the only people who if I feel like it's everyone's body, their choice, and if they want to take it, but it. But I think they should consult to a medical licensed physician. Okay, why even say that? Just consult to your doctor to whether or not you, and ask them whether or not should you take the vaccine. All right, you don't need some multi-million dollar goddamn company telling you what the fuck you do. You know what I mean? <laughs> well, apparently Roger Goodell decided to put in this bullshit by saying and I by sending a message to all 32 teams that if they do not get the, that if that's tier one tier one staff personnel and players that they need to get that they need to be vaccinated in fact up the in fact they decided to up the ante by saying that if you that if your team does not if you don't have any that if your team doesn't get vaccinated if the players are not going to get vaccinated or will not um or if the players do not get vaccinated and they don't um and the NFL can't find a way to reschedule a game due to an outbreak then that team will be forfeiting a, will be forfeit a loss will be a loss meaning that if a team if the NFL will not will not um have that means if an NFL team does not have vac does not have any players who are fully vaccinated and if the if the NFL cannot reschedule a game, cannot reschedule a game for a later date because of the outbreak, then that team who who has the out who got who started the outbreak will be will 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 get a forfeit in the game, which is an automatic loss. While the team they are supposed to play, they will get to them, they will get an easy W. Which is bullshit to be perceived honest. And honestly, I feel like this this is so stupid. Because listen, I get it that there was outbreaks that there were outbreaks and I get it that they had to reschedule some games. I remember a lot of people kinda of peeved off about that, especially the especially the part where someone actually said where the students had to play on a Wednesday night Wednesday night football. Like who and they had another say who plays who plays football on Wednesday night? I'm like, the fuck. I I I looked at them and was like, what you trying to say, man? You you saying that we the, saying that you don't want football on Wednesday night? I mean, shoot. Who, I mean, shoot. You know. But it is what it is. But you know, I feel like and like I said, it's gonna be bad on so many levels because it's gonna be stupid and uh. Well, lo and behold, well, lo and behold, after I made that vid, well, this came out today. So the Minnesota Vikings has fired assistant, assistive offensive line and run coordinator, 
Rick Dennison. Yes, 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 we all saw this happen. Yeah, I did saw this happen. Yeah, he got fired. Yeah. Everyone's trying to say, oh, he got released and everything. Like, they have to do a bigger political. But I'm just saying, bro got fired. He got fired, man. Reason why he got fired? <laughs> Simple. He got fired because of one reason and one reason only. He got fired because he said he wasn't gonna take the he wasn't gonna take the vaccine. I mean, like I said, there's gonna be some people. Like I said, there's gonna be some people who don't even want to take this vaccine. And what people need to what people fail to realize is that there's gonna be some people who are not gonna take it, and then there's also gonna be some other and there's also gonna be some people who who are going to take it. And if you, and honestly, to be perfectly honest, forcing if forcing people to take it even to take a vaccine, even though they are skeptical on this whole thing, is is kind of stupid. But but you know what's even more stupid? Firing a person, fi making a person, firing a person, costing them their their job and livelihood because oh they they decided not to take the vaccine. Which is scumbaggery, which is scumbaggery in, in its finest, but you know, but they did say that they have that you can that the only that the only reason you don't have to take it is for religious purposes, which is what the f which I have no idea what the fuck that fuck they are, but whatevs I guess, but still, but still firing the dude because he. Because he said he doesn't want to take a vaccine. I mean, seriously, what companies fail to realize is that you know there are things. There's this thing called choice. I mean, you ever heard the old saying, "My body, my choice." <laughs> oh wait, I forgot that only apply. Yeah, nailed it. I'm a badass. Yeah, I guess that. I guess that only applies when we had to deal with the ever so tiresome, boring, some bullshit of bullshit of abortions, because because that debate, because you know that's the debate that everyone tends to agree on. I'm dead. I w I wish I was. Tr I wish that was true, but I just said it. Said it. Probably wonder how many people are gonna be pissed off when I say say that one. Well, you know, it is what it is. Oh, and um, he, but yeah, like I said, this is really gonna be, this is really uh bad. And the fact that NFL is forcing this this stuff on the players, kind of not. It's not gonna, it's not gonna bode, it's not gonna bode well. It's really not gonna bode well. I mean, heck, you even got the uh DeAndre Hopkins, one of the league's top wide receivers, who might be thinking that he might retire, retire if he's forced to take the vaccine. Like I said, this is not pretty, to say the least. Oh, and also, but you know, oh, and also Patriots uh, co o line coach uh, Cole Popovich will miss will miss the twenty twenty elect the twenty twenty one um uh season. I don't even know. See, this is so stupid, and the fact that 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 um the that um the goddamn idiot himself um Roger Goodell managed to bring put this on here. It was so stupid, and he should be at fault for this, and he's probably might be at fault for this. But you know he's trying to act like this. I mean, and also I don't know why he's trying to try to do this because it, last time I checked, the NFL, despite it, despite the bullshit that they had to go through. They actually managed to they actually managed to complete a season for once. Ah shit. I mean, say what you want say what you want about the shield and it's bullshit, but at least I mean at least it at least it finished the season. And that's saying something, to be perfectly honest. Well, like I said, we'll see how this one plays out though, but honestly, I feel like this is really bad on the I feel like this is really bad. On the NFL's part, but we'll see how this plays out. As always, be but I would like to know what your two sets of the whole thing is. 
As always, be sure to leave a comment, like this video, subscribe to the channel, click the notification bell so you don't miss another update, share with your friends, share your neighbors, share your significant others, and that's about it. Until next time, this is Darkstyle 2K7, aka Son of Skies, this is signing off. Catch y'all later, please. Oh, and fuck you, Roger Goodell. Fuck you. For implementing this bullshit, you fucking idiot.